OK, so without further ado, let me give you an example of how it sounds. Now, don't panic. There's a lot in here, but we will do it bar by bar. This is just a little demo. OK, here we go. Something like this. So there you go, that's it with the strums. Now, depending on how far we get, we may introduce some finger picking as well. Now I'm not gonna play all of it now, but I'll just give you an idea, as in, in contrast to what we've just done, which sounds something like this. And so it goes on. So that's just a little taster of what we're going to be doing in this lesson. I hope you like it. It's a lovely piece. And uh, yeah, let's see where we go with it. So first thing to do is have a look at all of the chords. OK, so let's have a look at what chords are in this piece. There's a lot of repeats of these chords, so there isn't as many as you think. Even though we've got three pages of music, there aren't that many chords. The first one I want to look at is F plus C, and it is literally what it suggests. So you hold an F with the normal fingers that you would, and with your pinky, you're going to play a C major at the same time. So if I take that off, you can see it is just a C. If I take that off, you can see it is just an F. But we want to combine them together, and it's F plus C. Sounds like this. OK, a chord we must have done thousands of times, a G major. OK, then there's an A minor. Uh, then there's an F on its own. And then perhaps the first chord everybody learned, which was a C major. And then we have an E minor. Uh, a minor we've done, G we've done, F plus C we've done, G we've done, A minor we've done, F we've done. As you can see, there's quite a lot of repeats. Ah, on page two, uh, second bar in, it says G7 sus4, OK? It isn't as difficult as it may sound. It's literally a G with a C as well. So again, like we did the F plus the C before, this is a G plus a C, but it does have a name, and that is G sus4, OK? So let's have a look at that chord in more detail. Uh, the number for it is 0, uh, 03. Uh, zero two three three. Okay, so you're probably wondering what is this finger doing on here? Well, you'll notice on the sheets it shows in green. It's because we're going to do this first, and then we're going to go to a G. So just by moving this finger away, it, it becomes a G. So to start with, let's try the G plus the C together. And then by removing our pinky on that C, we have back to a regular G. I just have a go, a few goes at that, doing something like this. Easy peasy. OK, uh, I'm now having a look back at the piece, so F plus C. Now we've got a G7 inverted. OK, now if you're not sure of this chord, let me help you. OK, remember when we did an F7 down here? Uh, so that is 2, 3, 1, 3. I don't want to play that chord, I want you to use that shape. 
okay so we need that shape everything moving up to the third position and I say third position why yes that's because my index finger is on the third fret so an F7 shape on the third position gives a nice inversion of G7 and then the A minor plus C is literally what it suggests is an A minor and a C at the same time we keep getting a lot with this C don't we you'll see why when we get into the piece um, just going on to uh, I think we've done the E minor already yes we have um, looking on the last page now is there anything new in there yes there is on the second line down we have an F add nine okay so you use as normal fingers you would for an F and then pop that one on there and you may say Peter why do that because you're blocking this one why does that need to be on well in effect it doesn't okay however your next chord is going to be an F major so you may as well have it there ready yeah makes sense of course it does so we're going to have and then we're going to resolve it to Now it might go very quickly, so like... And again, that's the reason why I've asked you to hold this F in place, even that, no matter what you're doing on the second string. Perfect. Um, I think that is all of the chords. So have a practice of those chords and we'll take ever such a short break and join me after it. Okay, take a break. Death. <laughs> 